Chuck. All right, fitness team. Today we're doing mostly body weight workout. We're still going to get some punching in, although I'm going to move this up a little bit. To start off, just moving our hips backwards a little bit. Cross your body. It's an extra super fast, super hard. Just want to get your muscles moving around before we start using them. And then over the head. Down. And forward and backwards again. Stop and then drops. And back up and down again. Shoulder joints all wind up, loosened up. Excuse me a moment while I let someone else in. Or let's move that thing. Good. And then from here, just alternating knees. Doesn't need to be super high, super fast. Just put your legs moving over. Rotate. We keep doing the same thing, but switch your feet. Which is the other side of the So you get that same rotation on the other foot. Keep going. Hello. And then we're going to switch and go to hooks. We keep that same side forward for now. And then switch to the other side forward. We still just keep going with hooks by across. Now keep that side forward, but just rolling uppercuts. Roll the shoulders through, get that back shoulder to come in front of the shoulder. Again, comes up past the head, those shoulders engaged. And then switch your feet and keep going. And then let's go back to alternating knees again. Right knee and then left knee. Right knee and then left knee. Now you're going to have this side forward, you're going to go punch, hook, knee, and then knee. Straight punch, hook, knee, and then knee. Straight punch, hook, knee, and then knee. One, two, right knee, left knee. One, two, right knee, left knee. Keep going. Pretend I'm still with you. Okay. 
And now I'm switching over to the other side. So then you go this side, cross hook, left knee, and then right knee. Cross hook, left knee, right knee. One, two, knee, knee. One, two, knee, knee. Big ranges of motion. Not fast ranges, just big ranges. Cutting these muscles to a nice big range. All right, so now alternating front kicks. So still alternating, but now we're extending the leg out a little bit. Or a lot of it, because before we weren't extending that out at all. Straight leg, left leg. Now you're going to go right leg, left leg, and then jab punch. Right leg, left leg, jab punch. Or left leg, right leg, jab punch. Whatever the back leg is first. Leave the back leg. Leave with the back leg. Back leg, set, one, two. Back leg switch, back leg switch, left leg. Back leg switch, back leg switch. Lead hand back, and I guess I should say, because it depends on your side who's forward or back. Okay. Two. Punch, punch. And now switch it which other side for you. Leave the back leg, switch over the other leg, which is now your back leg, and then front hand back in. Back leg, back leg, because we've switched from the back. Two. Two. Or you can think of it as punch, punch, kick, kick. Whichever way, it's all flowing, so it doesn't really much matter. Just moving our muscles before we get working too hard. Get sweat going, and then we'll get a lot of sweat going. Twenty more seconds. And time. Just one moment. All right, so, sorry, I'm harassing Heidi for not being online at the same time, just in case you guys were wondering. All right, so, uh, it's only because I'm creeping down or I watched the walk across the thing over there. Um, so, now we're going to go high knees, mountain climbers, push-ups, skaters. This first round, we're still just going maybe like 60%, 70%, pick it up a little bit, but not a crazy amount, right? So, we're going to start off with high knees, and then we're going to mountain climbers, and then push-ups, and then skaters. So remember skaters who were jumping side to side 
and things like I'm touching my foot behind my back or at least trying to get my heel up to my backside, right? We're gonna do 30 second rounds and it's gonna be actually 20 on, we're doing this Tabata training, so it's gonna be hard, 20 on, down, 20 on, down. So what did I say was first? High knees, ready, get set, go. We might as well just go ready to with these. And then we'll take a 10 second breather as we switch to the next one, right? So just bring your knees straight up, even with your waist. And we're going to do this one for the full 30 seconds. Let's see. And then we'll have a 10 second breather as we drop down to the next one. And 10 second breather. And then we're going into mountain climbers. So around the ground and think knee to the opposite shoulder. And that's where it goes. Knee to the opposite shoulder. And then 10 second breather. And then push ups come next. And that's it, go. A 10 second breather, and then we hit speed skaters. And three, two, one, let's hit it side to side. It comes all the way up. It's like you're kicking yourself in the backside. And a little breather, so you get a full 30 seconds off. So each one has four exercises. Next one is going to go jumping jacks, squats, split lunges, which are the jump lunge, into jump squats. Well, not jump squats, sorry. Burpees. So we're squat thrusts. Down, out, in, up, down, out, in, up, down, out, in, up, down, out, in, up. Ten more second breather. And waiting jumping jacks. We'll do the first one for the first full 30 seconds. Go. Now we're jumping jacks. Full range, get those arms big, full range of motion. Like you're sliding them across the wall behind you. So instead of them being out here, straight up and down. Those shoulders working. And then on the next one, squats. You barely need to breathe if you're going to squats, do we? Right? And that's it. Straight down, straight back up. Make sure your knees are tracking straight forward over the toes instead of bending inwards or bending outwards. Straight over the toes. Into the knees and the waist. Back seats flat. And then the next one, we go to the split lunges. So lunge, jump to the next one. If you need to step to the next one, that's fine. Don't worry about it, and go. If you have to step, that's fine. You can pop from one to the next. That just pushes your heart rate a little bit more. Keep your body upright. Get your body over the hips. Instead of leaning forward, we want this to be a leg exercise, not a back exercise. And then we go to burpees or squats as deep as you can go. If you're doing the squats, add the arms in just to get your body moving, right? So, full range squat thrust. If I'm just doing the squats, then I'm going to bring my arms involved and get my arms moving with it as well. Just to add a little extra cardio work to it. Remember, if you're doing the squat thrust, Shoulders back. 30 second breather. Next round. 
We're starting with push-ups, and then we go to V-ups. So those are gonna be knee stretches, point the fingers and toes, and then touch that, right? And then we go to cross behind lunges, and then we're jumping rope. So it's off with push-ups, 30 seconds, and that's work. And breathe, and then we're going to be ups. 10 second breather. And that's work. Point the fingers and toes, and then touch that. If this is hard on your back, then back to the ground, arms extended. You just bring the hips up. If you want to reach this way, put that in, and that's fine. And then cross behind lunges. And that's work. Remember, the foot's going behind you at a 45, not quite 90. That's a little steep for this one, but definitely not straight behind. Let's see where it crosses each time. Body upright still. Don't let your body lean as you go down. This as far as my flexibility lets me go. That's as far as I go. And then rest. So now the next one, we go bridges up and down. Oh yeah, we get triceps too. So this one we're doing dips. If you have a chair close by, use the chair. If you do not, then you can go on with a straight leg and go this way. We're just gonna squeeze in the arms. I like the chair, it gives me a bigger range of motion. And then we go to plank jacks with a push-up. So we go jack two times, one push up. Beautiful after that round. And then box jumps. So if you do have a chair and you want to jump out of the chair, great. If you want to jump on and jump down, fine. My body doesn't mind jumping up, and jumping down doesn't work so well anymore. Right? So, or you can just pick a spot on your floor and hop forward and back, but try and think hop up over it versus just short like the uh, agility rack. All right, so where were we? Bridges. Up and down, go. Hips up. Keep the toes off the ground. It puts it in the glutes a little more. And remember, if you squeeze the glutes in the way up, don't just do the exercise. I'm making these. Then squeeze the muscle glutes with any specific work. That mind muscle connection. We'll back up, and then the next round is the tricep dips. And next work, triceps. And we drop and we go into push ups. And that's work. You can toast my arms for sure. And then we go to, uh, oh, we weren't supposed to do push ups in that round. We were supposed to do the plank jacks with push ups. That's all right. Box jumps. And keep going. Oh, go. And breathe. And then 
We're back to the first one. 30 second breather. All right, so the first one, high knees, mountain climbers, push-ups, speed skaters. This round, I wanna try and go a little bit faster than the last round, or I don't know, whatever helps to pick up the intensity this next time around. High knees, go. Might be that this is faster. And of course, you have to know your body. I can go this pace and my body's okay. I'm not gonna start going any faster. My ankles start yelling at me. And 10 second breather and then we're down for mountain climbers. Three, two, one, hit it. Twenty seconds, come on. As the same goes, you can do anything for twenty seconds. And then we go to push ups. Oh, we're down here. Three, two, one, go. Full range. And then, speed skaters. Take those back sides. And we're off. Let's up, side to side. Breathe for 30 seconds. And then in the next round, we go jumping jacks, squats, split lunges, back to burpees. We'll take a full 15 second breather for 30 seconds. 15 more when I set it. 10 to go, and then we go to jumping jacks. And off we go. Full range. Circles with those hands. Ten second breather. And then we go into squats. First time too, I said, go. We really needed 10 seconds. This time I was like, that oh, 10 seconds feels nice. Next time we go through this, we'll probably be going, where is that 10 seconds? Are you sure 10 seconds is out there? And then off of that, we're going to do split lunges or jump lunges or regular lunges, whichever works best for your body and pushes you the hardest. Off we go. Giving myself a reminder of posture at the end. Burpees, or squat chest, or squats with a reach. That's work. Shoulders back. Yes. And rest. 
Next round, start some push-ups. Instead of V-ups, we're going to do elbow to knee crunches. I'm going to change that each time we do that. And then we'll go to curtsy launches. Oh, you know what I forgot last time was jumping rope. That's okay. 10 seconds and then we go right into it. Push-ups start us off. 30 seconds. We'll get the full 30 on the first one always. After all, we just came off a 30 second break. And then I'll put knee crunches and hit it. And then off of that, curtsy lunges or cross behind lunges. That's work. I just think about calling this a curtsy lunge. And after all, in martial arts, this is known as a crossing stance. So, cross behind lunges makes sense to me. And then we have to jump rope. And that's work. On the toes. Jump, 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 jump. Push. I guess you can pretend you're jumping rope. You can do whatever you want with your hands here, really, right? Just this little bounce. Keeping the heels off the ground and bouncing in the ball of the foot is the key, right? And then next round, bridges, tricep tips, plank jacks with a push up, and then we go to the box jumps again. We'll take a full 30 seconds in between. A lot of these about as protocols we call for a minute rest in between sets like this. I find a minute is just too long. I feel like I start pulling down. All right, bridges, push, hips up. Toes up, drive through the heels. Squeeze the glutes. Up, tricep tips. And that's work. Big range of motion with your body, actually. Shoulders have to go through this range. Go for it. Doesn't need this thing. Squeeze the arms. And then we go to plank jacks with a push up, which would be much simpler than just another set of push ups. That's work. Jack, jack, one push up. Jack, jack, one push up. And time. And then box jumps. Three, two, one. That's work. Push. 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 And Thursday, Brady.
one more round. There's a review. The first set. High knees, mountain climbers, push-ups, skaters. That starts with high knees. Three, two, one. That's work. Knees up. Interesting why not? If I pull my toes up, there's not as much pressure in my ankle. If any of you also have ankle challenges, see if that works for you. Gentle on your body because you also don't have the cushion of being on your toes. I happen to be on that, so I'm okay. And then mountain climbers. And that's work. And then we might as well stay here. We're doing push ups next. That's work. Now I've got two guys, but my arms are getting fatigued. And then skaters, side to side, kick the back side. This one, if I get pulling up my little toe on the outside, so I'm hurting the ball of the foot and the heel. It feels better. It feels flat. There's like pressure outside on the ankle. Give me a little break. Next round, jumping jacks, squats, split lunges, burpees. Take a full break. Getting close. Kind of. All right, jumping jacks, full range. This one, I just kind of jump on one foot. You have ankle issues though, just step. Or you're swinging your arms. You can do the same with the stream dance. Or you're swinging your arms, but they're making snow angels. Air angels, that's what we could call these. Instead of jumping jacks. And then we go to squats. That's right. Easy boots on the way up. Focus on the muscles you want to work the most. Now at the same time, if I felt like my quads needed the most work, I could squeeze my quads, and that's where I'm going to feel the burn. And by the way, if you want to make that transition also, go more weight on your toes versus your heels. That changes where you're at as well. Um, split lunges in terms of where the focus is on your muscles. That form, back up tall, where you still get the hips, the body will get hips. Burpees. Or squats and arms, swings, whichever one you're doing. And that's work. And oh no, you're just. 
Cool. And then the next round, start through push ups. And then we're doing toe touch crunches for the abs this time. And then the cross behind lunges. And then we jump rope again. So, start with push ups. First round always gets 30 seconds. Whose idea was that? Let's work. And then flip over, toe touch punches. That's work. Yeah. 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 And we're back up, foot cross behind lunges. Slowly getting through, of course. And then we're getting up part. We're just slowly getting into part. And jumping rope. And it's work. So you're bouncing on the balls of the feet. Get the ball of the feet off the ground. Don't let your heels touch. If that bothers your ankles. Just see if you can pulse heels up as high as you can get them without the bounce. I think it's going to give you heels way up. You want to see that. Oh, those are just a few way up off the ground. Oh, those are rough. Um, so now we go bridges, tricep tips, plank jacks with the push up, box jumps. Last round of these. We're going to do a couple other things too. We don't have a whole lot of time left, so we're going to want to cut them, I promise. All right, bridges. That's work. Down. Go up the back side, come back all the way down. And tricep tips. And that's work. My chair to the push up. Next work. Jack, jack, push up. Jack, jack, push up. Push. Push. And box jumps. That's work. Ish. 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 And time. Oh. 
All right. Posture exercises. Fingertips on the temple. Oh, we're already there. Actually, we're going to do this one anyway. You guys know it. Fingers on the temple, elbows out. We use it as a cool down. Forward stretch. Three, two, one. Close enough, Bill. This goes forward. Mind from itself. Body straight ahead. Do this. It's a posture exercise. Doesn't mean you're any good if you're not standing with good posture to begin with. Shake the arms out for a moment. And then arm circles. Palms down, small circles, forward go. Again, pay attention to your posture. Feel if your shoulders are even, your hands are even with your shoulders. Last couple of rounds. Ten second breather, shake them out, let it hang, and then palms up and we go the other direction. And go. Check your posture. Bring your hands. Breathe. Breathe. And time. And sit back in the heels. One press up. Hmm. And push up to lunge. Right. Pushing up is easier in the beginning of the class. Oh, I forgot. Stretch the here first. Okay. Look stretched. And then reach. And back down. Switch. Hips first. Watch out, that's Reach. Back down. Remember, hands forward a little more. Push your shoulders back. Bring your body up. Get to the ground. Okay, so it's under. Heels in the mat, stretch its calves out a little bit. Open the hands down, hips up, push your palm. Heels, the fingers in the palm, and hips up. And then sit back. Good. 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 And relax. Nice job, team. Another sweaty Monday. Thanks for burning some calories with me this morning. <laughs>